what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back if you are new here i'm starting to do this new series right now you know what i'm saying starting this new series man and i have to say i have to say that i'm very curious to see where this is going i have no idea what this series is about somebody suggested it so i said let me jump in it's a very recent series that happened on netflix probably about two or three years ago i think they're in their third season or they've just finished up finish airing their third season for the show i don't know what to expect the only thing i know is that this is a german show it is pretty much all german actors with you know english dub which i'm not going to be doing the english dub i will be doing the original um german audio and we'll have english subs so if you're a guy that don't like to read uh it's probably not the reaction for you <laughs> i'm gonna be honest it's probably not gonna be the reaction for you but um yeah so what i'm going to do is for shows like this i for tv shows i usually do full screen because it's all in english but i usually have subtitles so for this i'm probably going to make myself a little bit smaller so that i don't get in the way of the subtitles um because you need to see them as much as i do or i'll probably use my anime screen i don't know um we'll see how that goes but as i said i have no comments i'm jumping to this completely blindly so let's take it slow let's do um one episode if one if the first episode is fire i might jump into a second episode and give you guys two episodes to um to jump in with <clears throat> as for myself but you know if if, if it's interesting enough then I will do a second episode and tack it on to this reaction. But if not, then we'll do the second episode another time. So that's what I'm about to do. So let's jump into it. And don't forget, guys, hit the like button, turn your notifications on so you know when I put out more dark um, reactions. And also, um, don't forget, don't forget, guys, to come back to check out the review. Okay? so thank you guys so much if you're new to the channel i don't put my reactions up on youtube for a lot of reasons i don't want to deal with the headache okay i don't want to deal with the headache i don't want to cut up cut up cut up cut up cut up and put stuff on youtube yes it hurts me in the algorithm i know but listen a lot of people are doing what i'm doing now okay a lot of people are crying to people to get their channels back and all of this other stuff because they're uploading this stuff to YouTube. Listen, I'd rather put this somewhere else so that even if YouTube should come at me about it, I can easily just delete all the links from 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 the YouTube and stuff like that and still have my reactions intact and put them somewhere else. Or whatever the situ whatever the situation is. You're not paying for nothing. I'm not sending you to no Patreon and stuff like that. So don't worry about it. There are memberships available on the channel so you can join from there. You can join the memberships on the channel. Um look at what they offer and you can join the channel from there. But in any case, let's go. I will see you guys right back for the review. So the link is in the description, guys. Link is in the description to go watch the reaction and then come back and watch the review right after that all right so <laughs> my god my god you know as i was saying at the end of the video i love a good time travel story now it's always most most of the time it's always the same the same old same old but this one my guy this one i might be hooked on this one i love a good time travel story because it's so interesting it is so interesting um you know what i'm saying it's 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 like the matrix it's kind of it's kind of like the matrix where you wish that you know what i'm saying you know you not necessarily wish 
but you know there's so many people out there that think that life is a simulation i don't think that life is a simulation but there are people that believe that life is a simulation and we need to connect to the real matrix whatever the situation is right so you have those typical time travel movies or or tv shows and stuff like that and i'm always watching these shows because regardless of what it is about or how the spin that they're gonna put on it i'm always interested to see you have the typical one where you know people travel through time trying to t change things in the present and all that stuff and explaining things you know if you change things in the past they're gonna change in the future and and, and you know the whole mix up right but this one i think is probably going to take the cake for me and probably go down in history as the best and i'm two episodes in and i can already tell that this show might be the one that i've been looking for this whole time as a time travel mystery you get what i'm saying because the thing is there's so much mystery around this you know what i'm saying i know that it has something to do to do with time time traveling and and stuff like that that's why i'm thinking that maybe the guy that showed up in in um in 2019 the guy that showed up at the hotel or whatever i'm thinking that that person is freaking um mickle it could be it could be mickle um because young mickle traveled back in time so maybe his present self now is older and in 2019 it's a weird situation i don't know how to explain it but all i know is that this is full of mystery he just met his dad in 1986 he doesn't even know that that's his dad bro that's crazy but you're telling me ulrich has been living in that same house bro the same house he grew up in that house he grew up in that house and also um got married lived in that house had his kids in that house um even though he's a dirty down cheater or whatever and you know he ain't gonna get no respect for that you know um there's some really sketchy things going on at the power plant i don't know if they're the ones that are responsible i don't know if this is some government sanctioned shit or they're just testing some shit on kids um to see if this time travel thing work or whatever the situation is i don't know what it is all i know it is very extremely interesting that's all i can say i'm intrigued thank you to all you guys that suggested th this show man um because i'm hooked two episodes in i'm hooked because i think this is not going to be your typical time travel bullshit and you get what i'm trying to say like i've watched a, a lot of them anything that has to do with time even some things that i thought that was going to be really great turns out to be very typical you know um you know most of them always dealt with like you know people in history and stuff like that our our ancestors and you know going back to to um to see certain people back in their heyday like uh, einstein mozart people who have who are still talked about to this day as the, the um the greats or the goats of humanity if you will so to go back and see certain things happen and you know and you know um one of the shows that i really enjoy how they do time travel right now in there i think it's the final season is agents of shield and agents of shield is is one of those shows the only reason why i started to watch agents of shield is because i'm a huge marvel fan so i wanted to see um you know what they were going to do and you know over time you know there were some seasons that weren't as good as some of course but i think they've been doing a good job of keeping the interest going and this final season is dealing with time travel um so it's kind of like and it's pretty cool how they're doing it it's just that the acting is just not there you get what i'm saying the storyline is pretty good but the acting of of the actors um the new people that came in um to the to the cast 
is not great at acting. You know what I'm saying? Of course, Clark Gregg is still doing his thing. Um, the other people that are that are in the show, um, Chloe Bennett, and you know, um, um, the lady, the Asian lady that plays May, they're still doing a good job. Mac still doing a great job. The um, the I don't remember her name. The um, the English lady. Um, I, I don't remember their name, guys. Some of them I do remember. Um, but as I said, they're doing a great job over there of telling a, a comprehensive times time story about time, right? Or time travel, right? So in this year, dark, they're doing an excellent job of setting up, you know, what I want to see setting, setting it up, but yet leaving some things off the table to, for it to be mysterious enough for you not to understand the plot right for you not to understand the plot because in some ways it's kind of like okay what happened to to jo to Jonas's or Jonas what happened to his dad why did his dad kill himself why does he have a map of the power plant or it seems like it's an underground map of the of the power plant and and rooms and different sections of an underground operation is it government sanction we don't we, we don't know we don't know you know um so there's plenty that's going on that needs to be figured out you know what i mean plenty that's going on we don't know you know what i'm saying don't know anything really don't, really don't know anything i just know that from um from a synopsis of watching two episodes i i can say this has something to do with time travel especially based on how episode two ended so that's pretty much all i got but anyways thank you guys so much don't forget to hit the like button i'm trying to to do better newer stuff on the channel um as we go along you guys are probably not going to see this for a very long time because i'm i'm recording this so early um so you guys are not going to see this for a while but anyways whenever you see it you see it right so thank you guys so much leave a like leave a comment in the comment section of course and as always man as i always say gratitude is never enough it's your boy terabyte reacts and i will catch you guys later man <laughs>